Easily add slideshows to your app layout, including Ken Burns effect, manual and automatic swipe. You can easily add a slideshow by first creating a picture box using the picture content tool in Quark Express. Open the HTML5 palette to add the slideshow enrichment. Add individual slides by choosing Add Slides from Picture File. You can add slides one by one or multi-select images to add more than one in one go. After you imported images, you can adjust their size by just using the normal Quark Express picture commands, keyboards and mouse commands. Do that for each image that you want to adjust by just selecting the slide in the HTML5 palette. Choose from many options in for slideshows. Allow interaction allows the user to manually advance the slideshow. Allow full screen allows the user to double tap the picture and see the picture in full screen mode. When you also check show uncropped in full screen, the image will be shown uncropped when being in full screen while showing the cropped image when showing on the layout page. Choose autoplay to automatically advance the slideshow and choose from three transitions between the slides. Create custom Ken Burns effects by using animate pan and zoom, choosing the duration and clicking on start to define the start position for the Ken Burns effect including zoom level. Click on stop to define the final zoom level and position of the picture. And do that for every picture that you want to custom animate. Visually control how the Ken Burns effect will look like. For each picture you can add a custom action that will be executed when the user tabs that image. For example, choose Go to URL to open a web page when the user tabs the first image. Alternatively, add Quark Express layouts as slideshow members. Specify the height and the width of the slideshow member and the number of pages. Use any of the Quark Express design tools to design your custom slide, including caption with drop shadow and transparency, and any interactivity that you want to add. Upload your App Studio layout to preview in a browser or in the test app. Simply choose your organization, publication, issue and article title. 